Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is TBR Schmidt and this is my wife Samantha. Hello. And today we are watching Cobra Kai part two of season six, episode six. What'd you think of the first part? <laughs> first part was great. It moved so much faster than I thought it was going to. Like we are already at the competition. Yeah, we're already at the competition. We only have five episodes left of this show and then that's it. There's three parts. Is there? No, I think there's only two parts, right? There's three parts. There's three parts? What the fuck? <laughs> okay, never mind. We have five episodes that we're about to watch. Of this part. Of this part. <laughs> but we are at a place where like, yeah, like you said, we're moving fast. We're already at the competition. The team is not probably the correct team. There's some cheaters. There's some interesting choices. And there's some interesting people on the opposite side as well, which is like, how the hell did we let that happen? Yeah. Uh, so there's a lot going on. We just literally finished watching Best of the Best. Yes, just finished it. Very recommended that we watch that prior to this. So we did. Yeah, we don't know what the impact or influence or references may be. Yeah. But we watched it just in case. But yeah, so I guess we have five episodes after this one. So there's more Cobra Kai in the future. And then there is the Jackie Chan Karate Kid movie that we haven't seen. Yeah. And then there's also a new one coming out with Jackie Chan and Ralph Macchio. I think that's his name. Mm -hmm. Daniel LaRusso, mm -hmm. which that'll be interesting to check out in the future. So every time you think uh, Karate Kid and Cobra Kai is dead, they keep coming back with more. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'm very excited to see how they conclude this show in general, but I wasn't expecting to get where we're at so quickly. There's been a lot of like turmoil and fighting and things happening behind the scenes. So very interested to see how this plays out. I'm excited to get into it. So if you'd like to see the full length reaction for this, as well as everything else that we've reacted to, the link to our Patreon is in the description. If you would like to interact with us on our Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram, all those links are in the description as well. And with that, let's get into the episodes. Sakai Taikai. Welcome competitors, sensei sponsors to Barcelona. Oh, that's right, we're in Barcelona. This is karate tournament, the Sakai Taikai. <laughs> Captains, step forward and tie on your headbands. Oh, that's right. The whole Mr. Miyagi backstory. Team events begin tomorrow. Did you know? Each event counts. Oh. And they will all be a surprise. Yeah, because no one checked up on her. Good luck. And welcome to the Sekai Taikai. Although I'm blanking on her name. The blonde. Peyton? Peyton? No, no that's, that's the actress's name. <laughs> <laughs> this is what happens when they come out in parts. Can't remember shit. Yeah, we gotta take care of the driver. You guys go ahead. What a shit show this is, man. You know, Tori's here because he's Tori. Tori. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Johnny. Tori's mother just died, and you still wanted her to fight. All you did was feed into her anger. No wonder why she went back to Creed. Creed gets in her head, and we've already lost. We're not losing. We're taking him out of commission. No, you're not. No, you're not. We may not like it, but we're in this thing together. We're here next to each other, not together. Yeah, that's kind of a problem, guys. You are the famous Miyagi doll. You do not look like much. It's not worth it. Robbie's right. Forget about them, okay? Just any other dojo here. Yeah, except for that. Things are really terrible there, huh? Uh, hey, this is all business. <laughs> Mingling with the sponsors is my chance to make a good first impression for Miyagi Do on the world stage. Who's taking a shower? Yeah, I was like, who's in the shower? Is it Johnny? Or water pressure out of a damn garden hose. Roommate, on the other hand. The shower's just sneezing on me. Yeah, hey, don't touch that. They're uncensored. If you move them, we can. Well, he already moved them. Hello? Uh, necesito nueve cabeza de uh, shower. How do you say? Just call me a douche. <laughs> I knew you were not a leader. I don't want to be. I only took the captain's spot so I can be the last one fighting. And you'll be the last one losing. Great. Great, great coaching. <laughs> I was my sensei's first student, and it's been my life's honor to spread his teachings to the next generation. Maybe we should let Daniel handle this side. Whoa, dude, really? I'm entitled to enjoy as many pieces as I like. Yeah, well, maybe I'm entitled to stop you. Hey, 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 sorry about that. What happened to literally everything we talked about? <laughs> this is our moment, Johnny. Yeah. Let's not blow it over nothing. All right, all right. 
I mean, if Johnny almost lost it over steak, he's 100% gonna lose it. You there in the back, smile, show some emotion. Show emotion. Get one more, okay, never mind. <laughs> Are we going to have some fights before the fights? We handle international licensing for Jojo specific gear while also providing official Sakai Tekai apparel. Any idea how old this is? It belonged to my sensei. Shh. You mean like paying for college? Yeah, and then so. I'm Sensei Lawrence, by the way. Be careful, that point is very sharp. Oh, don't worry. I know how to handle a blade. I keep my own very close. Good job, Chris. One good swing of these can get the job done just as quick, wouldn't you say? Well, uh... Well, I think most people would rather be holding the knife. Oh. It's not about the weapon. It's about who's using it, right? He's like, uh, <laughs> what did I walk into? <laughs> When Chris came to you, this is what it was about. He's using you. You know that, right? I seem to remember he helped you when you had no other options. I know you've made your decision. You said we'd stick together. Sam, don't fuck this up. Why'd you even come here, Sam? Yeah. So the uh, opportunity I get <laughs> <laughs> to, to say terrible things to, uh, to a Sam. No one beats a mine. Team USA. Everyone knows America is best at everything, right? Yes. Hawk could for sure beat that. <laughs> USA, USA. So this really isn't. They're just egging them on. Huh. Oh yeah, don't look at the blood. This one man who might know something about this, Master Serrano. Serrano, legendary champion. Everybody knows this. Well, obviously not. He was even living here in Barcelona at one point. I can try and get in touch, maybe get a number or address. That would be incredible. Yeah, super helpful. What if I tell everyone about your little prison escape? All the charges would drop. Self-defense takes many forms. Were they dropped, really? You already know that. I think so. What the fuck? I still don't think it's acceptable to escape prison. He escaped prison, regardless if he was innocent or not. We don't need to do this anymore, all right? We all have too much at stake here. Some of us have nothing to lose. You want to level threats, you son of a bitch? Come on, right, back off. Get your hands off of me. Oh, Chosen. Oh, watch out, Chosen. <laughs> I am with Miyagi-Do. Learn name, Miyagi-Do Karate. It's Chosen drunk. This isn't a good idea. Toughest guy in prison, right? You said that? No, I didn't say that. I, I don't agree with that idea at <laughs> all. No. You know what, this is dumb. Yeah. I said that, whatever. Yeah. Hawk, don't hurt your leg or something. Come on, guys, we're leaving. Good. You always walk away from challenge? Or is it because your friend is on our team? God damn it, God, don't fall for this shit. You got this. <laughs> Show him what's up. Like the angel and the devil <laughs> on his shoulder. Yeah. Let's be calm, people. Let's do it. You kick, and I kick. You win, you get to my room. I win, I get to your room. What, just swap rooms? I guess they don't swap. They get like their own room. Ah. Uh. I'm worried about you. I'm worried about Robbie too. We need him on this game. Devin, let's go. Sam, what the fuck? Every single time someone starts to get slightly close to Tori, Sam just comes in. Sam, wait. I'm not gonna say that I'm sorry. I, I didn't want things to be like this. I would have helped you. I just wish you would have come to me or to Robbie even. I went to Robbie when Chris first came to me. Did she go to Robbie? Give it a good running start. Yeah, that Russian guy that went before you? I'm telling him. I know the physics. I'm going to a school world renowned for it. Oh, wow. Uh, I'm going to NIT. <laughs> I get Guys, it. Guys, finish You quit it. Come on. Everyone needs to squash all of their beef. Yeah. Wow. I have a feeling this is going to be absolute light work for this dude. <laughs> Yeah. Don't worry. I leave your bags in the hall. <laughs> Man, that's crazy. You mean to say that the guy who's like four inches taller kicked about four inches higher? Where you been and why are you drinking so much? I went to Okinawa. Uh, 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 Kumiko. 
That has to be a mistake. Shower, Hannah. Shower, man. Huh? But flower. Flower? What, what, what flower? How come it cold? This is bad. God damn, Chosen. I'll create all of the flowers. I think perhaps it's time to leave. Oh. Good job, Chosen. You gave the situation five seconds. You knew Chris came to Tori. What? I mean, I knew that Chris went to Tori, yeah, but it was before her mom died, and he was trashing Miyagi-Do. He played her. He played you. And you lied to us about it. Lie. It's not that big of a deal. That's not fair. I yeah. can't lie. Miguel? Come on, really? This is the fallout for whatever his name is? <laughs> Robbie. <laughs> like, what was he, what would have changed with this situation if he would have told people? Like, you guys should have been there for Tori. After, regardless after her mom died maybe someone should have checked up on her instead of just letting her walk away oh i feel like robbie should go to tori's room maybe this might be a better time to talk i think we should just focus on karate while we're here so, so this is a breakup a pause Trust me on this. No, I wanted to be there for you. Any one of us would have been there for you. You don't trust anyone but yourself. Great, yeah, he's definitely in a much better headspace. <laughs> Welcome to our first event. We call it the Captain's War. If you hit the mat, you are out. If one of your captains hit the mat, your entire team is out. Hey. Rube, you up. Oh, of course. Already? Cobra Kai. Of course. Taking Miyagi Do first. I know them. They're going to protect the egg. We need to attack. Can you just stay out of the way and don't fall down? You think she would know since she used to train with them? Right, but she's a woman, so let's not listen. <laughs> Why wouldn't I be focused? You did leave the hotel room last night. Damn. I know. Bunch of snitches. Go do it. Give them no choice but to follow you. We do it for each other. Wipe the smirks off their ugly faces. Yeah, I think an early loss for Cobra Kai. Here. Yeah, I mean, uh, for Miyagi. For Miyagi, though, Miyagi I though. agree. Oh, okay. Dimitri's gone immediately. That's fine. Just keep Sam. <laughs> Oof. That was quick, Hawk. My Robbie. Where are the other two? Oh, come on. Already we're facing off. Oh. Thought she already went down. Nice, nice. Miguel. You're going to two on one, Tori? They might need to. Robbie just needs to stay up. No. They already hate Robbie. Only Cobra Kai and the Iron Dragons remain alive. All six are still standing. It's easy to strategy now. How old are those people? Uh, yeah, right? Those are like 40 year olds. And there's only three of them? What are they doing? Oh! Oh, they're making it even. Oh! What the? They only left their captains? Who are these guys? I'll take the little girl. You two get the big guy. That was nothing. Well, it's already over. Both Cobra Kai captains go down. The Iron Dragons win. Uh, <laughs> who? Welcome to Barcelona, bitch. Uh, <laughs> I think Miyagi-Do and Cobra Kai might have been paying too much attention to each other, and they forgot that the rest of the world is here. Who the fuck's that guy? I mean, the steak stealer. 
I feel like I've seen him in another show, too. Is this a big reveal that we just missed? Do we know who that is? I don't think we know who that is, because, I mean, Johnny already met him. Oh, Chad. Robbie, Jesus, dude. Get in there, get in there, be aggressive. Just take it slow. No, not take it slow. Oh my god, guys. Yeah, well, we need to start going big. 17 points, they're in 11th. Man, Miyagi. Are they still even in this? Barely, they're almost in last place. All right, this morning's event was tough. But Terrible. We're going up against the best dojos in the world. Best thing you can do right now is just clear your minds and I'll put this behind you. You got this. I believe in you. How do you expect these kids to master Miyagi-Do if one of their senseis keeps calling it bullshit? You know what's bullshit? Letting them keep losing because you care more about honoring some dead guy's legacy than doing- Oh, John. Dang. A little far. Someone left this for you. Oh, is that the bill from the minibar? I gotta go. This is important. More important than the tournament? We still have a few hours. Yeah, all right. Well, don't come back until you get your damn head on straight. Hopefully this does it. What if we just skip the rest of the events? What, you're already giving up on the tournament? There's no way that we can win. God, dude, we get it. You're going to MIT. You should let them know about your rank-ass farts. No, no, no. <laughs> hey, Miguel. Dude, you okay? No one is okay. You guys all suck. I don't know about Robbie, man. I don't know what's going on in his head, but he is not fighting the same. I mean, at this rate, it's not going to matter if we advance because he's going to be the one fighting for us in the finals. You all think it should be you out there. I mean, Robbie won Captain Fair and Square. Yeah. They turned on him so quick. How about someone try to help and talk to him? Some mysterious, potentially dangerous fighter in the middle of a country where you don't speak the language. Hablo un poco de español. <laughs> I thought we agreed to move on from digging into Mr. Miyagi's past. If this guy actually knew Mr. Miyagi, he could shed some light on what really happened. I mean, come on, I gotta at least talk to him. This is when Serrano could meet, and it's not that far. I'm gonna be back in plenty of time. And who knows? He's not coming. Be careful. Love you. I will. I love you too. I feel like this is Crease. Oh, you think Crease is fucking with him? Yeah, like I feel like he just La dirección está ahí abajo. Está seguro que... sent him on a wild goose chase. I, I shouldn't be too long. Do you mind waiting here? Uh, espera aquí. Tourists don't come here, huh? Starting off strong. Senor. Solo cinco euros. You scared me. De nada, senor. Gracias. You might need that. This must be the place. Oof. Jeez. <laughs> Came out of nowhere. <laughs> Supposed to be here 15 minutes ago, LaRusso. I was looking for my dad. Have you seen him? He stepped out because he got caught up or something. Once you have fallen, you are out. Points are determined off of wins, losses, and time. We will now call up the first group of fighters. I feel like they do good on the platform. Yeah, they've had a lot of training with that, with the platform on the water. When we're waiting around like scared little bitches, waiting for them to come to you. All right, you go at them. My dad would want balance. Your dad's not here. Sora Haruto from Hiro Bukan on platform one. Miyagi-Do on platform two. Hey, Sensei. It's not the best. Right. Oh! Fall on your ass again. All right, we need to do better. Let's go. After that, you all need to step up, all right? He's in a cage. <laughs> I feel like you might be onto something. Maybe uh, Chris did just set this up for him to get captured. Oof. Uh oh, not good. Oh, there you go. Nice. All right. Oh, crap. Still moved down. We're near the bottom of the standings. There's nothing to celebrate here. What? Yeah, you can celebrate the small wins. We keep going like this. We get eliminated tonight. 
and you're gonna go on to live shit lives in shitty apartments with shit jobs. Hey, all that from this? You keep blaming us like this isn't on you too. If my dad had been there today, we never would have lost like that. Yo, he didn't show up. Probably because of you, trying to prove that your way is better when it's so clear that we should have been using Miyagi-Do. You shouldn't even be wearing that gi. Hey! Whoa. Your sensei got you knocked off the board in 10 seconds, so I would sit down if I were you. You're not helping us. I don't even know how you made this team. Damn. I mean, she made it by cheating. We'll be putting all of this behind me when I'm off to MI. Just shut the fuck up about it. <laughs> Some of us actually care about winning the tournament. Be nice if you did too. Guys, can we just cool it? Uh-oh. We need to focus up. Maybe you should listen to your own advice. Hey, I'm not finished. No offense, Sensei, but I'm pretty sure we've heard enough from you. Cool. Everything that could go wrong is going wrong. He led me down the wrong path this whole trip, and now I don't know if I'm ever getting out. Oh. Can you use this to escape? That might. Sensei, can I talk to you? I just I just wanted to get here so badly. To, to prove to you and everyone that I'm a badass, but I ended up doing something I regret. I knew I couldn't be Kenny, so I had to cheat to make sure I would win. And, and now I'm here and I'm getting demolished out there. I can't compete with the others. Finally admitted to it. If I had a dollar for every time I'd done something I regret, I'd be a gajillionaire. <laughs> One thing I'll never regret is all the work I put into students like you. I'll take my share of the blame for this Kenny situation. And if I ever pushed you beyond your limits, it's because I know you're capable of more than you think. Just think about kicking ass out there. About Kenny, look, I'm not gonna be the first to say anything. I'm gonna leave it up to you how you wanna come clean. All right? That was good. Yeah. The first good thing that's been said here. And it's just from a conversation. Like, these people just need to talk to each other. Go warm up with the others. I'll meet you out there. With that, like, off her chest, she'll do a lot better for mm -hmm. sure. Hey, LaRusso, look, uh, it's me, it's Johnny. Listen, uh, I know I said some things like, you know, you shouldn't come back or whatever. <laughs> Just get your ass back here. Oh, he's out already. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus did it. <laughs> Oof. Oh, whoa. Cobra Kai. Cobra Kai? He worked for Chris. Oh, sick. Finish him, Daniel. Nice. Headed with a bunch of classic Miyagi Do moves. This isn't over. Some newfound motivation. Go, hey, can we talk, please? You have the opportunity of a lifetime right now to be captain of our team, and you're completely blowing it. You've lost every single one of your matches. It's like you don't even care or something. But you're also going to be the reason that we go home with nothing. So either man up or admit that I'm fighting better than you and hand it over. No. I mean, he needs to get his head in the game. He needs to get in the head, his head in the game, but he did win this captain spot fair and square. The dojos who do not win tonight will be headed home. The previous rounds have determined... Miguel's trying to get into, like, Stanford or something. But if he doesn't get into Stanford, his life is going to be totally fine still. Whereas Robbie has, like, zero <laughs> options moving the forward. The rules of the event... Fighters will again face off on a platform. This platform. Okay, it's a bigger one. Two fighters from each dojo are allowed at one time. One of your fighters falls. They are out. That's a pretty decent fall. Yeah. But another teammate can climb up to take their place. Get up there quick. Do not leave your teammate alone two on one. <laughs> How do you climb up there? I don't know. Next up, Korea's Cobra Kai versus Sweden's Polar Slime. Good save. But I believe with every bone in my body that you can do this. You guys know a lot more about balance than me. So remember everything Sensei LaRusso said. Use all your Miyagi-Do skills to stay up there. Start strong with our captain, Sam. Robbie. And Devin, you'll go next. Good. <laughs> I thought he was going to take that shit off. Kind of started. Oh, never mind. They're in the middle. Dude, Robbie. 
Robbie, are you fucking kidding me? I'm trying to root for you here, dude. It's okay, Robbie. You got this, champ. Go. Yeah, Sam's up there. Oh, there we go. Back up. Don't look. Just get back into the fight. Uh oh. Stay up, Sam. You're so tough, or I'll show you tough. <laughs> Dublin. <laughs> Sam. All right, Hawk, hurry up and get up there. Yeah, get some two on ones here. They both going down? <laughs> Just straight up tackle her. All right, go get him, kid. All right, Hawk and Dimitri have to fight together. Dimitri, you sent them both over? Oh, shit. Oh, Dimitri, it's so easy to hate you. Hey, watch how it's done. Sure, Miguel. Oh, I hope so. I know. Is it just this guy left, though, for them? I think so. It's going to be one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, two on one. Get him off. Yes. Wow. That was good. Yes. <laughs> hey, Rosa. Hey, what, what? Slow down, slow down. I wonder what happened at home. You were missed at the events today. <laughs> you think you could fuck with me? It's only a tournament. Dad? What did we do here? We made it through to the next round. Guys, I, I promise I will not let you down again. I feel like it's gonna just be Daniel because something's going on with Johnny. Yeah, if something's going on, Johnny's gonna have to leave. Is she, did she already give birth? That's what I was thinking. Did she already have the baby? I got a call from Rosa. Carmen's been rushed to the hospital. I guess something went wrong with the pregnancy. What? Talk to Miguel. We're leaving tonight. Focus on getting there, all right? And just leave everything to me. Thanks, man. Miguel's leaving too? Yeah. Well, it's his mom. Yeah. Fuck. Can they sub? Can they get Kenny there? Yeah, they might need Kenny in there. All right. That was episode six and seven of Cobra Kai. What'd you think? I feel like that was a pretty strong start. For to... part two? Yes. You know, we've said it before. The kind of communicative fights that continue to happen are a little bit old. Yeah. I will say that. But I think it is very interesting that they have really put Miyagi Do like at the bottom of this. Yeah, they're at the bottom. And it's also interesting that Cobra Kai is also not necessarily at the top. Like it's these new Iron Dragon people who are like coming in just dominating everyone but yeah i mean these last two episodes i really enjoyed them yeah but they're just filled with issues with miyagi though everyone yeah and it's all personal issues and it's like come on guys have we not learned anything at this point you guys are all the way in barcelona right trying to win this and you're got you guys are letting your personal fights and you know we have Hawk and Dimitri with this whole MIT thing. Robbie's just continually getting distracted by Tori. Miguel is obviously pissed about the captain's position, even though he really did lose fair and square. Right. In that Sam with the whole Tori situation as well. Um, and Sam and Johnny fighting as much as they are. Johnny and Daniel fighting. I mean, it's all just garbage. I mean, in these two episodes, you only had one good conversation mm -hmm. and it was between Johnny and Devin where she was able yes. to come clean yeah. and Johnny I think handled that conversation very well yeah. gave her a lot of support and understanding um because it's not like they could just send her home because she cheated or something but I think they set it up for maybe Kenny to come into the picture and then that would maybe gave, give her an opportunity to come clean to Kenny Yes, yeah, I believe so as well. Very interesting though, because you've now put, you know, something in this with Carmen 
taking Johnny out, but you were also taking Miguel out. Who's clearly fighting the best. Yeah, I mean, Miguel was the sole reason that they were able to move on. Yeah. So very interested to see how that goes. This isn't like, a, oh, we gotta go to the hospital real quick and check. Like they're flying back nine, 10 hours. So they have bigger things going on right now than this tournament. Right, but it's not like that they could just, they go home, she's okay, and they just come back. I doubt it. Exactly. So very interesting how they're kind of gonna work this. Yeah. I think this whole tournament has been a surprise so far with the amount of fighting and the individuals that are there. It was already surprising, but now getting through it, having them pretty much near the bottom and even more fighting and now losing Johnny and Miguel, it's just like, this is not their tournament at all. I mean, it gives them the opportunity to come back from the very bottom to win it all. Yeah. So we'll see if that's the case. Yeah. But to like rifle through the issues, I mean, you have Tori, who's now in Cobra Kai, and I feel like all of these conversations are terrible because you have so many people on Miyagi-Do who are like, we would have been there for you. Like, why didn't you come to us? And it's like, she was there at Miyagi-Do when everyone found out and she walked away and absolutely no one went for her. No one yeah. followed her. Like, that was your moment. You're, you're saying that you would have been there and you would have helped her. You missed it. You missed your opportunity to go after her and help her. Yeah. And that's why she's on Cobra Kai. So it's like, what do you expect for all of these people to come to tour and be like, well, you should have come to us. No, you should have gone to her. Yeah, it was not her job to seek out like support. Yeah. And then you have obviously how that's affecting Robbie and all of Miyagi-Do, they turned on Robbie so quick, even though he rightfully earned that captain spot and he is considered to be one of the best. If he's maybe tied with Miguel, sure. But in that moment, he beat Miguel. So it's like they turned on Robbie so fast, yeah. but it's so easy for any, all of them know exactly what the issue is. Yeah. They know the issue is Tori, yet no one's having a conversation with him. They just got angry and pissed at him because he's not fighting to what his standards are. But it's like, you could probably resolve this with a conversation or with helping him with the Tory situation. Yeah. And you'd get his mind back into it. And then you would have the one of the best fighters back. Right. But they were just like, nah, fuck you, Robbie. Yeah, no, I think they're not being good teammates to each other. They're not respecting their senseis. Like, it's just such a disaster. Yeah. Um, and then for Daniel to fall for something as stupid as that letter was so ridiculous. Like, you know what you're dealing with with Crease. It's not like it's like a shock. Like... Yeah, I mean, I think we were both getting a little annoyed in the first part with how this whole Miyagi storyline was just deteriorating Daniel. Mm -hmm. And it still seems to be the case. It literally uh, sent him down this chase and then he is just out of commission for a little bit. Yeah, and I mean, even Amanda's calling him out. Like, what yeah. are you doing here? So... That's frustrating. Um, and I guess my last major frustration is Chosen. Yeah, like, Chosen. Chosen, what are you doing? Like, I don't know. Like, the whole, like, regardless of what's going on, if he is heartbroken, whatever. But I feel like he's such, like, we've gotten a lot of good humor out of Chosen as well. But this seems like way too far out of character. I can see him. it out of character. Cause yeah, sometimes he does feel like, like a stabilizing force in yeah. some situations, which is interesting. But yeah, I mean, again, Cobra Kai definitely leans heavy onto like the misunderstanding as a motive for story development. Right. So that was such an obvious situation where it's like, that was probably her like nephew or something like, yeah, like there's no way that that is the actual truth. I'm sure we will revisit that, but he did not show up and like some, you know, uh, Kumiko's with some like 20 year old boy or yeah. something like that. Uh, so a, a little bit of a ridiculous plot line, but then even how Chosen is handling it. I mean, he's done nothing but cause chaos since being here. Yeah, and then he's just been like, he caused all that chaos and then he's just been in the hotel room getting sick. Yeah, so it's like, like oh. <laughs> He's not even been there to help or no. to balance between Johnny and Daniel. So I don't know, there's just so much going wrong. I mean, there's also like to touch more on uh, Dimitri and Hawk, best friends for like all of life. Mm -hmm. You can't figure this situation out and it's still, 
every conversation is about MIT or about hating MIT. Mm -hmm. And it's just like, there's so many situations that can be resolved with a conversation and with a little bit of understanding. And the only one we had was Devin. Right. And then she did great. Like she performed really great after that conversation. Yeah, I think she got someone else out and then she took someone out with her. Yeah. So, so I mean, yeah. Look, look what conversations <laughs> can do. So yeah, it is it is uh, very understandable <laughs> to why Miyagi-Do is in like almost dead last yeah. because they are just riddled with issues. Yeah. And even when you think that it's going to turn a corner at the end there, and then for Johnny to have the issue back home, it's like, okay, how are we going to get through this now? Yeah. So I'll be very interested to see kind of what's going to happen. I am predicting that Kenny is going to come in. Yeah. Or could they convince Tori? Oh, to take me to switch teams. I don't know. I don't know if that's a thing. I feel like that's less likely than bringing Kenny in. But again, we're talking about like, 10, nine, 10 hour flights here. Like it's not, like it's super easy to just sub people in. So that's why I was thinking Tori, she's already there. That's true. But I don't know if that's gonna happen. So I'm interested to see how this plays out. I'm ready like to get right into the next episode. I have a feeling that like, or sometimes I get like sucked into just what I expect a story to do where it's like, you think Miyagi-Do is gonna be victorious and win it all, but I feel like they won't. I have a feeling no. that they won't win this competition. No. Maybe Cobra Kai will, or maybe Cobra Kai is going to lose to this Iron Dragon. I don't think either of them is going to win. So I feel like, because now that I know that there's a third part, <laughs> when I thought there, I, th I thought this was the, the final part, no. now that I know that there's more, I feel like Miyagi-Do could still lose this situation, but there's still more storyline that might come because of the loss. Yeah. Not like they're going to have some victorious win and we're going to ride off into the sunset no. into the end of the, the show. Yeah. And the fact that they're doing this so early in the season, like I don't even think we're halfway through the season and we're doing the tournament. I think this is not, I thought this was going to be the final finale. Yeah. And it's not. Yeah. So very interesting. I really enjoyed these two episodes. Great choreography and fighting. I feel like everyone brought their A game. The tournament is really interesting. The new villains that they kind of brought in. Yeah. But yeah, I feel like we've sometimes it's just like you want them to work together. And then the show just keeps giving you reason after reason after reason for them to like not cooperate. And it's like, please, for the love of God, give me an episode or two where everyone is on the same page. Right. But I'm still enjoying the show very much. Yeah. Yeah, no, me too. So if you'd like to see the full length reaction for this, as well as everything else that we've reacted to, the link to our Patreon is in the description. If you'd like to interact with us on any other types of social media, all those things are in the description as well. And with that, peace, everyone. Bye. Bye.